So, I have been waiting and waiting and waiting for the new Dark Limited... Well, I, I was thinking there was going to be limited edition character, and I was thinking, hey, it'll probably be the Dark type character, right? But I've been waiting for it, and there was nothing. So far, the only thing that showed up is Asuna. This is the Bride Asuna. And how this would probably work is if they extended the dark event then they could have the limited dark characters right so they have the dark bride asuna here i gotta say she is not anything special in terms of skills uh she does have increased damage when she does her incarnate 15 percent um as well as continuous damage but she's a caa character nothing too good i think the other one is better the enhanced mode version, but if you want a new design Asuna, there you go, right? So let's get back out of here. I do want to talk a bit about the uh, bride or wedding, whatever you want to call it, the bride Asuna, and there's the Kirito. He is in the wedding suit. I guess they're going to be having this holding hands with you, and they will probably release it. It really makes me think if I should spend my dark Moon Crystal. I already spent it on Edis, but if I buy the pack, then I still have 200 more, right? Which means that, um, you know, you either choose to spend it on the Dark Enhanced Mode Asuna or Kirito or this Asuna. And looking at this, I don't really like her. To be honest, looking at her, she has thrust. Let's see her speed and stuff like that. She's kind of slow too, 305. So she's slow. Her... Charge is not that much, is 20%. Her thrust, she recovers allies, right? The enhanced mode version, Asuna already recovers allies. So there's nothing special about that. Raises critical damage of all allies by 7%. That could be beneficial. I don't know. But maybe it is. I don't know. I mean, I barely use the raised critical damage buff, right? I mean, I'd rather have the increased... Uh, attack by certain percent than critical damage and then let's go down a bit yeah her third attack has recollection field again it does raise the critical damage but like i was saying i was thinking she's a slow character anyways i guess the only beneficial thing is that she's a thrust character opposed to the other character which is a magic character and there is not a character that adds uh physical debuff yet that is new so i was expecting them to release something like that but i don't know looking at it now i don't know what they're doing with the limited edition character the only thing i could think of is that they will extend the dark ranking event which is already unfair i don't know for me anyways for my dark ranking event i'm like i'm in second place and i'm already up to seven hundred i mean seven million so or i mean the, the top player is at 7 million, right? So, I don't know. I mean, I have a lot of stuff, but I I am not getting to 7 million. At least I don't think so. And it kind of makes me feel bad because I already have number one for the two of the, two of the titles already. And now I might get number two or number three. Who knows? But I already spent my moon crystals, right, on Edis. And she is actually, she does quite a bit of damage. But looking at my team, right? You got physical here, you got physical here, you got magical here, and this is the only magic character that has magic, lowers magic resistance by 20%. And then she's a magic character. Now, she is a must-have character. She's not going to do much magic, but she's going to be yell, yell, uh, charge yelling, and critical as well. Risk crit critical damage by 10%, right? And then there's this Asuna if you want to use her. But the thing is, I'm not, I don't know if I, I really want to use her. She's in there, but I need a character, another character. I could replace her any time. So I'm just waiting to see if they actually have a new or two new limited edition character. They might only have one because they, it used to be one limited edition character, right? So if you, you put this into perspective, if they're releasing the, the Bride Asuna, which is here, right? We were looking at it. Um, the one limited edition character would be Kirito wearing the suit, but who knows, right? Who, who knows if they're releasing him and if they do release him, 
they would have to extend the event. At least they did it before. But nobody knows. No, I don't know. I mean, I could be I'm looking forward to this. We'll see what happens. But I do want to see the suit, the wedding suit Kirito. And obviously, the Synthus character, in my opinion, is not that great. I'm probably going to wait for the suit one and see what happens. But those are the two wedding characters. I don't know when Kirito is coming soon, but Asuna is coming today or tonight. Which means, who knows when the other one is coming, right? Or Kirito. But hopefully, they extend it. Or, I I don't know if I... <laughs> it's a good thing if they extend it. Because I already used up all of my Dark Moon Crystals. So, anywho, two characters you can be expecting. First one, you know, it's guaranteed already. The Asuna, the wedding bride Asuna. I like that. And you have the Kirito, which is the groom. Right? He, he, he is the white wedding suit Kirito. And he's right there. <laughs> 